Toronto's bicycle-powered train is back on a roll now that the kinetic artist who built it once again has access to the facilities needed to maintain this unique creation. A kinetic artist is an artist who builds things that moves. Jean-Christophe had gained some popularity online after first revealing his train a few years back, but ran into some trouble as COVID-19 related restrictions started coming into effect. When I was out of school, I did not have any workshop, so it was hard to work on the train. I brought it to my house and dismantled it in pieces in my parents' backyard. He says the pieces fell into disrepair. He describes feeling sad thinking that the train may never again see the light of day. But with restrictions lifting, he was recently invited to show the piece at an upcoming event and saw an opportunity to bring it back to life. This is all going to get painted? Yes. What, uh, what portions are you going to paint? So all of it. So here it's going to be silver. And then here I'm going to wrap it with plastic a colorful plastic. What kind of color? Oh, it's going to be... <laughs> it's going to be many colors, like uh, the traditional steam locomotive from the 1800s. So it will be blue, silver. This is going to be black. The cabin is blue, red. And um, like this, it's going to pop. <laughs> now it looks like a, a homemade thing. But soon it's going to look like a real, you know, steam locomotive. Oh yeah, super proud, super proud, yeah. Meanwhile, his sister says the whole family is cheering him on as he races to get the refreshed project ready to show. We all know the talent that he has, um, but to see him putting into work and seeing people seeing that as well, see what we saw uh, for so many years, it's amazing. When he first told you he was going to build a train out of what was a tricycle, like what went through your head? I mean, it's very normal for him to do things like that. Like he's always made super odd, cool looking stuff. Like he's always been that brother. Do you get a lot of people who, who stop and ask questions? Yes, all the time. And uh, they all become like little kids when they see my train. And they all ask, you know, what is, it, what is it for? What's the purpose of the train? The purpose, he says, is to share the idea that we can make our dreams into reality. And with the dream nearly complete, he also tells us he'd love to see this piece make an appearance in the city's Santa Claus parade or maybe a music video. Before departure, we always need to, to, to check if the oil is all good. All aboard! In Toronto, David Zura, City News.